La Ailev Regia Honagui of Galair. I'm out in the beautiful sunlit garden here at Curasush in Kilran, County Wexford. You see the sun has moved up in the sky there after a spectacular sunrise. We have masses of these three cornered leeks everywhere. No snowdrops, but loads of these beautiful little white flowers. So blessings of Bridget upon you all. I'm taking in my broth regia from the front door where it was last night, gathering Bridget's blessings. And it very, very much feels like spring in the air. Looking for my alder now to show you the catkins on it. Um, where am I? Here we are. So, little alder catkins. There's more further down the garden here on the hazel. So, signs of life everywhere. And although it's not yet the cross quarter day of Imbolc, which falls on the third, it very much does feel like spring is being heralded in, which for me does start with Bridget's Day. So coming down here now to the hazel. I don't know if you spotted that little blackbird flying across there. So here we are with our little hazel catkins. Just seeing life beginning to burst forth again. Look at the little shoots ready to unfurl. Coming around now to the temple. This is where our classes happen for the priestess training. All in readiness for the next session. Just going to move now around to the front of the house, and you can see the beautiful sunlight coming through there again through the trees. There's my broth vrija, the healing cloth waiting to be brought in, just hanging on the door handle there. Cats in the window. More cats in the other window. There's one inside and that leaves one lurking somewhere. around into the garden. So on this beautiful morning with spring in the air, I wish you Bridget's blessings. And if you've done your breath, read your last night, 
you can keep it throughout the year wrap it around it around yourself when you need it for a sore throat or digestive issues wrap it around your belly or around your head for a headache but the other broth freesia is Bridget's cloak and I like to use this as a working as a kind of sympathetic magic and we remember the story of Bridget spreading her cloak and claiming the land for her convent in Kildare, Kildara and so that's the Riocht Brat Vrija we can use and so we can spread out a shawl or a cloak or a big piece of green cloth and just identify what it is you want to claim, what resources you need right now to manifest, what you need to make a reality, your intentions. And then just visualize that cloak or shawl spreading out, gathering underneath it everything that you need. And you mightn't even know exactly what the resources are that you need, but stating your intention to claim those resources or really good to use as a working for protecting some part of the environment, something in your locality, maybe a wood or a lake or a sacred well. And imagine that cloak spreading out, spreading over the area you want to protect or reclaim and bringing Bridget's blessing and protection upon it. So as a goddess of healing, as a smith, she's a really important figure to call to when there's illness, whether it be of mind or body, to call upon her for that healing energy, but also the transformation to transform the experience and lead you into a new phase. And as one who well, the story of her as saint is she was born on the threshold as her mother Brickshock had one foot inside and one foot outside. That gives her particular power over thresholds and liminal spaces. So as you move from one phase of life to the other, call her in as midwife to guide you through that change, guide you over the threshold. So I call Bridget's blessings upon you all Banakti Vrija Arav Gulier Gra Ox Banakti